Hey guys, Kane here. So as many of us have counted so far, to get a 6 star you are, it will cost you about 105 to 110,000 diamonds. If you pull that entire you are in just one altar, that would mean you would get 17 pulls of 10, and that in general usually yields about 250 scrolls, and then there will be no more chests left. So it will be just drawing another 17, and then you will need to make up for the free boxes as well, which was an additional 45 scrolls, which should add about roughly a 10,000 diamond cost. I'm not saying you will get this unit for free, or it is cheap, or any of the sort. To get it 6 star, it still costs a crap load of diamonds. But if you do 17 pulls of 10 in 2 altars, the cost will be 92,000 diamonds, for roughly about 500 scrolls. That will depend on your luck and all that stuff, of course. You may even be able to get 510 if you were just a bit lucky, then 12 for your average scroll pulls, per 10x. And that 510 is all you need to max a UR to 6 star, because you get 20 free shards from the achievements. So if you're not going to pull a specific UR in an altar that is here now, and you will in the future, it is better to split diamonds in two altars, rather than fully push for one in just one altar, which would in general cost 92,000 total diamonds plus minus your luck, versus about 105 to 110,000 diamonds plus minus your luck. However, there are some things that could change all of this. And you should know before you do any of that. The first one would be they can or may change the rewards for pulling in the altar. By that, I mean they perhaps can change Dragon Steel to Dragon Blood in the future, which would be from SR plus yellow barrack resources to SSR red barrack resources. Who knows, it can possibly happen, which would then make your current pulls a little less efficient in a sense. Second would be if 46,000 diamonds is all you have, any particular event popping out, you will be drained of most of your diamond stash. So if there would be any cheap deals, you will not be able to get them. Third, most other previous URs will most likely be added after half of the commanders are released. So if you do not plan on getting them now or will miss them, don't worry, you will get your chance in a few months to be able to get them again. So my advice, Plan ahead what formation you want to have and what URs will benefit you. My goal is at the moment Venom Spawn 6 star and Evil Sorceress as high as I am able, depending on the release order. If both of them are late enough, both will be 6 stars, hopefully. So I am not really bummed if both of them are last. Anyways, that's it for this video here. I didn't really want to put in, you know, insane calculations or anything as it is pretty basic and self-explanatory that pulling two altars is a lot cheaper than just one. Thanks for watching, hope this will help you and stay safe.